Tis the season for cozying up near a warm fireplace, and we have a new look from Hogwarts Legacy for the Hogwarts House common room fireplaces in game. Now we've already seen features of each of the common rooms from Gryffindor to Slytherin to Hufflepuff to Ravenclaw, but these images, these videos have a new angle for us to look at. At this point, we know that Hogwarts Legacy has a special relationship with PlayStation given that we got our own exclusive state of play and there are exclusive PlayStation Quest, as well as the many blog posts that give us more details about the game. I'll link in the description down below for the Hogwarts Legacy PlayStation page that has a variety of different content video features, all of that. So if you scroll down, there is a section, explore the Hogwarts houses and their common rooms. And you'll see each of the four. Gryffindor, we have this lovely fireplace scene with two lion statues on either side of the fireplace. Uh, you can also notice there is some movement from the little metal guard on the left hand side. It's kind of cute. Uh, then there's also cut up wood on the right hand side of the fireplace and you can see the drapery that we've already looked at from the Gryffindor common room feature. I'm very curious what these portraits have to say if we're able to talk to them as well. Key attributes for Gryffindor, brave, bold, chivalrous, daring, and clever. The emblem of course is a lion, house colors, scarlet and gold, common room location, Gryffindor tower. Slytherin, which features a solo chair. I wonder if you have to fight for that prime spot in front of the fireplace. Uh, we have some tea, we have uh, some bones, skulls on top for some reason. We have, of course, the skeletal structure that's in a glass case. And of course, snakes are everywhere. Key attributes are powerful, frequently misunderstood, great, cunning, power hungry. The emblem is a serpent, house colors are emerald green and silver, and the common room location is in the dungeons. Hufflepuff, and I love the kettle that is over the fire, heating up. You have this nice little arch around the fireplace that has actually, if you look closely, those are little badgers in different poses. It might be doing a tumble, I'm not quite sure. It's adorable. Key attributes are trustworthy, loyal, true, unafraid of toil, and hardworking. The emblem is a badger, house colors, yellow and black, and the common room location is one floor below the ground. And of course, Ravenclaw, which is my house. I am obsessed with the idea of having a fireplace that has a 360 degrees of seating arrangement. There are pillows that are kind of on the ground so we can be sitting just at the edge. Uh, there's also some chairs. Of course, we're gonna have stacks and stacks of books. And I like how the sticks are arranged. It just looks really cool to me. And the eagle that is prominently displayed showing our house pride. Key attributes for Ravenclaw, wise, eccentric, clever. The emblem is an eagle, house colors, blue and bronze, and common room location, the top of Ravenclaw Tower. Which of these fireplaces is your favorite? I am definitely biased and love the Ravenclaw one, but Honestly, if I were in any other house, I would probably wanna hang out by the fireplace because it just seems so cozy. You're gonna be warm. It's probably gonna be on at night, so it's just kind of unwinding for the day. I am looking forward to all of these little details that we'll be able to see across all of the spaces in Hogwarts. Thanks so much for watching, and until next time, wands ready.